I go in still. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm language versatile. That's how you say it. I'm in the building in Korean. I go to the Korean spot every morning to get my breakfast and shit. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm in the building. I'm in the building. I'm in the building. Battle rap continues to elevate properly. Properly. God MC. Loaded Lux, you know what's up when I'm rolling up. Beloved, go to the people we back to do maintenance. Yeah, it's smooth like crack. But again, you already know. So many punches, he gonna be yelling, get off the ropes. Look, shout out to ARP. Rare breed is Blue Room Essential. This is what they talk about. I'm, I'm just a blogger, okay, from Brooklyn. Uh, Shout out to the Wu, you know what I mean? Wu Tang Forever, Capadonna, I see you. YDB, I see you. I was selling marijuana that pill and me realize my trauma on the block pushing work. We dreamed of the Bahamas. I see the future. I go on after a seven dollars. Don't push me on the head. I don't want nobody. They always call me for life. I'm just trying to go. You know, I tell Jack to love with them in just a minute. Just stay tuned. Let's get back to it. Look. Blue room. Loaded locks versus Rum Nitty. Okay. Now, ARP is already saying. You know, max out for my hit before the end of the year. And if that does happen, which I'm sure it is, because that motherfucker's crazy, okay? Fucking shaking up the culture. It's crazy! Lawrence ARP, okay? When it comes to the culture, you know, we're on the same page, right? I've been to the Blue Room. The Blue Room is phenomenal. It's a bunch of people. Oh my God. Look, ladies and gentlemen, you know, as fans of the culture, you, you saw the gesture that I just gave. These are matchups that are legendary. And for ARP to book something like this in the blue room, it's history. Period. History. I just want to see it. Let's talk about it. You know, load of lux, man. We need more. I'm just keeping it real. The culture. You're full of culture, culture. Clearly. The way you rap is extraordinary. It's extraordinary. However, some people might not understand you, and that doesn't mean that you're nice. Okay? Shout out to Hollow the Dog. With who you are, with Rum Nitty, you already know what you need to do, right? You know what you need to do. You know who they came to see, right? Lux. Lux don't play with nobody. That's just, you know, neither here nor there. If Rum Nitty decides to take this battle, which he will, right, and decides he wants to retire after the battle, if that's the case, he's going to try to do as much damage as possible. He's going to try to get you out of here, Lux, but he could definitely fuck you up, Lux. Rum Nitty has the, the potential to do it. He has the performance to do it. He has the bars to do it. I can only imagine what he would say to you. Oh, there's so many ways to flip load and fucking run. He's a fucking alien. You know this, Lux. You know? I want to see it. It's just that simple. I want to see it, ARP. They call it you ARP. <laughs> Lux is Max out four. Rare breed ENT. Loaded Lux versus Rum Nitty. God tier versus Alien. I want to see it. I want to see it. I'm excited. Start down! Hitman. Shout out to Hitman. Shout out to Bags and Bodies. 
shout out to the culture culture for us doing us and holding each other down when the industry comes in here and thinks or, or when the world when the rest of the world shout out to remy ma and pat pools i'm gonna still defend you until the fucking sun comes up and go down again okay because it's just dumb okay you know? Shout out to my guy Greg. Wu Tang is for the children. That was my boy Corey Barnes. You know what I'm saying? Lavish lifestyle. But we was going back and forth, right? And a lot of people feel like it's crazy because they not saying anything about it. You know what I'm saying? I stand on what I stand on. You know? Like, they don't owe us shit. They don't. They really don't owe us shit. You know? But when you're a celebrity. I, I, hey, from what the world is telling me, because you're an A-list celebrity, you gotta have to do this. You should do that. You know what I'm saying? You make yourself look crazy. You know, when you're comfortable in your own skin, none of that shit matters. You know what I'm saying? Example: Rest in peace, Nipsey Hussle. Right? Some uh, a fan, if you may, paparazzi, if you may, whatever, uh, was filming him without. His permission. The lady was arguing with him. You can't do this. You, you're a celebrity. And so he said, I'm a 60s crap. Straight up. And and I felt it in my soul when he said that. Because a lot of people get it fucked up. You know, a celebrity is a celebrity. But they're human first. You know what I'm saying? Or they're a man or a woman first. You know what I mean? And you got to take into consideration that. You know? Not everybody is approachable. Not everybody is... A happy-go-lucky kind of person, you know? So with that being said, shout out to Remy, shout out to Papa. Yo, you know, it's one thing to speculate, you know, but I see it, shout out to Greg again. I see that he dropped this blog with the bitches telling you, saying that they getting a divorce. How the fuck do you know? So then they say, well, how do you know she didn't cheat? Have some faith in your fucking people. God bless my black oh. God bless us all, Lord. But yeah. Loaded Lux, Rum Nitty, leave in the comments who you feel is going to win. Yeah, so shout out to the culture, culture. I am Loaded Lux versus Rum Nitty, Guy Tim versus 